pressure coming again. Wilson steps up. Now throwing deep for Moore. Down there with Chin. Moore can't hold on. Good coverage by Jeremy Chin. And once again, the Jets O-line struggling against Carolina's defensive front. The most since 2012 when five rookie quarterbacks started week one. Wilson over the middle and it's intercepted. Shaq Thompson on the pick. Thompson into Jets territory. And out of bounds, just shy of the 30-yard line. For Zach here, he didn't put enough zip on this one. Downfield like this, you got to fire this ball. Shaq Thompson, just enough time to tip it to himself. He looked like a running back wearing number seven going down the right sideline. Eighth play of the drive. Wilson in trouble, and he is set. Matos combined to bring him down and Wilson is slow to get up pumped and ready to go But is he gonna run is he gonna talk it and run or is he gonna throw it down the field? That's gonna be a challenge for the Panthers well, He's got a big arm, but the pressure is out and he's gonna get sacked back at the 31 yard line Morgan Fox Was part of that combo that just crushed Winston He didn't have a chance Blitz is coming. Winston avoids it one way, throws, and this is going to be intercepted. It's a takeaway. Justin Burris has it for Carolina. On third down two, sacked at the 30. Winston looked one way, and Brian Burns brought him down the other way. Well-thrown ball from Winston to Jawan Johnson. You were wondering earlier in this game where he's been, and that was a nice pickup of 20-plus yards. Winston has time, holding on to the ball, throws, and that's another interception. It's J.C. Horn with a pick. Panthers coming with a blitz. It's picked up. Prescott knocked down at the line of scrimmage. And this number one defense gets a hold on third down. Hurts incomplete looking for the tight end Zach Hurts. A.J. Boye in coverage breaks it up and it's fourth down. More rushing yards among quarterbacks. This is through his hands into the end zone. It's loose. It's loose. It's loose and out of the back of the end zone. A safety but a missed opportunity for a touchdown on defense for Carolina. Third down and five for the Eagles. Hurts over the middle. Devontae Smith has it knocked out. It is a catch and a fumble. Carolina football. Dante Jackson and now Jeremy Chin bringing it back close to midfield. So productive early on this season. Nothing doing today. He's given time to take a shot down the sideline. It is Jackson. Is he inbounds? He is intercepted by Dante Jackson. Back-to-back -back plays with turnovers forced. Congratulations to the Slay family. Following it up with a good Sunday. He pumps short and gets pounded. Hassan Reddick. Oh, my goodness. Cousins from the gun on third down. Looking end zone. He throws. Incomplete. Tyler Conklin, the tight end, the antenna is... And this is what Jeremy Chin said he needed to work on. The man coverage, those one-on-one, -on -one, no help against Tyler Conklin. Gets his hands in there. And he actually gets both hands on it. That's a really good defensive play by Jeremy Chin. Second and ten. Cousins quick out. It's Jefferson. Ball comes oh. loose. And it's picked up by Hassan Reddick. And they fly around. Justin Jefferson, he needs to get used to how fast his defense is coming. That ball was clearly out. A.J. Bouye goes in, goes right after the football. And, of course, one of their best defenders, if not the best defender, picks it up. They dodge a bullet. Taylor could have had an interception there. Oh, the punt gets blocked! And it will be taken into the end zone for a touchdown! Frankie Luva makes the tackle after blocking the punt. He's all over the place. And... Kenny Robinson in his 12th 
NFL game, his first touchdown. Quarterback sneak. We'll keep it on the ground. Booker driven back, and it's a stop for Carolina. Sam Franklin stepping up. Well, they got all three guys covered on the inside. They get pushed right over the center. Billy Price and then Sam Franklin off the edge. And everything bounces out to the outside. Look at his perfect positioning. Dip, rip, wrap the leg. Jones under pressure and down he goes. Brian Burns right on cue. His first sack since the third week of the season. Second down and eight. Play action. Backside pressure comes and down he goes. Hassan Reddick, the NFC sack leader. Now seven and a half on the year. Second and eight at the 24 yard line. Ryan. In the pocket, intercepted, Shaq Thompson with the pick, and Thompson out of bounds at the 25-yard line. Matt Ryan with a glove now on that left hand, hands it to Cordero Patterson, and Hassan Reddick would not allow Patterson to get any momentum, and it's third down. And he's everywhere as Felipe Franks comes in motion for the Falcons. Ryan sets up the screen to Hayden Hurst. Oh, was that well defended by Shaq Thompson? They need two scores. Down nine with 158 to go. Ryan, backside pressure comes hit as he throws and it's intercepted. Stephon Gilmore in his first game as a Panther has a pick that should salt it away for Carolina to snap their four game skid. You see Kyle Pitts walk to the sideline and go get some Gatorade. You better believe the number nine, Stephon Gilmore, is going to be pouring it for him. He's not taking his eyes off of him. Jones. Under pressure and gets hit. The ball is loose at the 40. And picking it up, let's see who's got it. It's Carolina. Frankie Louvu. On second and seven, Jones. Intercepted in the middle of the field. That is Gilmore. Stephon Gilmore inside the 35 to the 33 yard line. Look. Third down and five. McCoy starts the game two for two. Wrapped up, loses the football. Recovered by the Panthers. Morgan Fox returning it to the 14 yard line. 180. Well, the Panthers 31 off the fake to Connor. McCoy throws back across the field and it is picked off. The second turnover of this first quarter, Dante Jackson with his second interception of the season. From the Carolina 40. Oh, what a play. Jack Thompson, no hesitation. That may be, Kurt. I love hearing a nice defensive dominance, dominating performance. Same thing we have here. Yeah, speaking of defense, Marquise Haynes with the sack. Second and eight, rather. Yeah, man, man. Gibson fumble. Ball is out. Loose on the turf. Carolina's got it at the 10. Frankie Louvu at the bottom of the pile has got the football in his left arm. I wonder how Sir Perf felt, felt about that. He thought it was perfect. Oh, well, Evan knocks it out of the park. DeAndre Carter. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Carter across the 30 yard oh. line. The ball's out. The ball's out at the 30 yard line. Carter dropped it and a huge pile up who ends up with the football after Julian Stanford knocked it out get him to communicate force him to make a mistake on second down and six Heineke in trouble down he goes Hassan Reddick got around the block attempt of John Bates and drops him behind the line of scrimmage ten and a half Miami's done a good job converting slightly ahead of the NFL average which is about 40 percent Tua with pressure coming, runs right into it, the ball's loose. And the Dolphins are on it way back at the 43. Brian Burns is the one who knocked it out. It looked like Jesse Davis from his tackle spot recovered, thankfully, for the Dolphins. From the 45 of Carolina. Tua out of the pocket, can it? No, he's thrown down. He had a chance to escape, but Phil Hoskins wouldn't let him go. It's worth a shot. 
Oh, boy. This may be a difficult thing to do as Tua can't come up with it. And without any timeouts, the Panthers have it. Frankie Lou Vu, the pitch. And this will come to an end as the half comes to an end.